two sessions left. That's it in 2015. So what should the retail investor be doing right now to protect the portfolio heading into the next year? We're bringing in Lee Munson, Portfolio Wealth Advisors, co-founder and CIO. We're sprinting to the closing bell here, Lee. The number one thing an investor should be doing in these next final two sessions. You got to be tax harvesting right now. You want to take those profits, some of the profits on tech, but don't write a check April 15th. So what we're doing and what people who are watching this should be doing is take a look at your big winners, probably going to be in the technology area. Take a look at your biggest losers, probably going to be in the energy sector. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to sell some of the profits in there, but then you want to offset it with some losses. Now, here's the thing. Don't mistake, Liz, a bad price performance, like say ExxonMobil down 15% this year versus a bad company, maybe some dot-com that's heading to zero. Mm -hmm. So for instance, you can sell ExxonMobil and then go in and buy the ETF XLE, which tracks the energy sector for 31 days, go back into ExxonMobil, and you're able to book that loss once the tax man cometh next year in April. And then if you do have some dogs and you're looking for some new money, think about next year. When Monday comes around, you have to think to yourself, is a dollar and energy really going to be going up and down this far into the sky? I would rather get something like e EFA, which tracks all the big developed international companies outside of the U.S. Why? Because they can sell stuff and export to the United States with a cheaper currency. Uh. And we can buy more of their stuff with our strong dollar. And, and by the way, at we're looking at the chart. You we're looking at the chart of EFA, and, and you're not buying at the top. I hate when people come on and say, buy this. Meantime, it's had a 40% run up. In this case, that wasn't oh. it. Lee great ideas. We're going no, to put no. them on Facebook.com slash Liz Clayman. Lee Munson, Portfolio Wealth Advisors, co-founder and chief investment officer.